Okay, today I'm going to uh, experiment around with um, uh, brazing uh, aluminum. This is one of the critical aspects of uh, my bicopter is um, is the angle of the uh, motors, and up until now I've been using um, rivets. I went to Harbor Freight and I purchased um, some of these aluminum ro aluminum rods. Uh, this is the very first uh, attempt at doing this, so I decided to videotape it to um, as a document to to um, show what I'm done doing. I took the liberty to um, wire brush these first uh, to remove any oxidation and um, uh, foreign material from uh, the outside. Now what I'm going to do is I'm going to attempt to um, braise those piece, two pieces together using um, just a, a normal um, uh, uh, propane torch. I'm adding these um, bricks just to keep it from moving about. Um, once I start, I keep them kind of somewhat in place. Okay. I'm going to start right here in this corner. Not doing so good here, huh? Let's see. Hmm. Okay, we just gotta get our technique together. Okay. Let's just um <coughs> It's gonna work. So we just gotta improve our technique. Okay.
messed that up. Okay, we're back. <clears throat> we're back for attempt number two. On the previous attempt, we um, tried to move it before it was ready, <laughs> before that set. I guess uh, uh, patience uh, is a virtue. the secret. That is to heat it up, remove the, um, the flame, and then kind of rub it. I just kind of like to have the rod kind of preheat it. over this side again. That is it. Let her solidify. Well, we're going to go back to Harbor Freight or order it online and um, stock up on this. <laughs> 